Diabetes type 2 is the most common form of diabetes. Although it can occur at any age, it is more common in people who are overweight, sedentary, and over middle age. Glucose is the main source of energy for body cells. When blood sugar levels rise, as is normal after a meal, the pancreas gland, located behind the stomach, secretes the hormone insulin. Insulin enters and circulates in the blood and acts on the insulin receptors present in muscle, fat cells, and other tissues of the body. Binding of insulin to these receptors causes the glucose transporters to come to the cell surface. This facilitates the entry of glucose into these cells. In diabetes type 2, the production of insulin is low and sometimes there may be resistance to insulin. The circulating insulin fails to facilitate the absorption of glucose into the cells and to keep the blood glucose level at optimum levels. This results in the rise of blood glucose levels. The excess in blood glucose reacts with proteins in tissues to form what are known as advanced glycation end products or AGEs. AGEs create an inflammatory condition in the vasculature, which causes heart disease and damage to other organs, such as the kidneys. Diabetes can eventually cause damage to the heart, arteries, kidneys, nerves, eyes, and skin.